All right, here's another super fun game idea from Derek Hafer. This one is called Pirate Ships, and you really got to try this one out. It's for grades 1 to 6, and you need cones, hula hoops, and bean bags. And to start, you're going to use the center circle of the gym, and you're going to place down four hula hoops for four different teams in the corners, and each team you can throw a penny onto uh, to distinguish them from one another. In the middle area, around that uh, circle, you're going to place down cones to create a big rectangle, and that's actually going to be the defender ship. So that uh, that represents the defender ship. And also, you're going to place down bean bags. If you have 40 or 50 of them, that would be great, or any number that you have, I guess that will work. And those bean bags represent the treasure. So that's the treasure on the ship. And basically, what's going to happen is you're going to choose one team who starts in the middle, and they're the defenders for the first round, and have a round of maybe two minutes. And so for two minutes, the other three teams, those are going to be the pirates, so those three pirate teams are going to go and try and steal as many treasures as they can, one at a time. So, well, not one player at a time, they can, uh, everyone moves around all at the same time, but when they get to a treasure, they can only grab one piece, not uh, grab a whole bunch at a time. And so on the go signal, they go, we see a player has gone in and got tagged. Anytime a player gets tagged inside the defender ship, then they have to go into their hula hoop, do five jumping jacks, and then they can join the game again. And so we've seen some players from the blue team got in there, grabbed treasures, and made it back safely. So that's the way that works. And uh, a yellow player has gone in, grabbed a treasure, but got tagged well inside that ship. So then that beanbag's got to go back onto the line. And then the yellow player goes into their hula hoop, five jumping jacks, and they get back out. Of course, we're only watching single players, but everyone would be moving around at the same time. So not just one or two players. Um, and, and entering that ship when they feel safe to do so to try and grab the treasures. And uh, once the two minutes are over, then uh, you stop the round, everyone freezes, and then you count to see which team has the most treasures. In this case, obviously the blue team, they had two. And uh, after that, you would just simply uh, start a new round, choose some new defenders. So now blue team is in the middle, and they would go for two minutes, and so on and so forth. So you'd have four, four total rounds uh, and before the game's over. And you can also, of course, switch that timing up. It doesn't have to be two two minutes. Try three or try five or whatever works for you. And, uh, yeah, that's basically it for the idea. Um, some of the things to note, though, is the defenders, they're not allowed to pile up bean bags in a, in, a, in a hill to make it easier to protect. They have to keep them one at a time on the line. Uh, defenders also cannot leave that middle area or the ship. They have to stay on the ship. They can't go outside. And there's no throwing of bean bags, obviously, for safety reasons. And before each round, uh, encourage both offensive and defensive strategy to the team. So to give them a couple minutes or, well, maybe 30 seconds to just talk about some of the things that they want to do for offense and defense, and so on and so forth. So again, thanks, Derek Hafer. Awesome game idea. Please consider subscribing to this channel if you haven't already, and uh, visit physedgames.com.